one lot of misconception are there regarding next exam and most of them are being spread purposefully by few people for their own benefits everyone has social media in their hands and more the money you have better you are in a position to spread the myths and rumors today i will give you clarity so that your entire fear about next exam will disappear there are protests going on in various medical colleges against next exam mbbs students are thinking that next is going to be super difficult and this will cause collapse of their dream of becoming mbbs doctor this myth has four dimensions the fourth dimension is the most controversial and i know that many teachers from coaching classes are going to criticize me for putting it so blindly but let me tell you all four of them <coughs> right now you need to prepare for at least two to three exams that is final year mbbs exam neat pg or inic is any of these exams easy absolutely not all these exams are quite difficult similarly next is also going to be a difficult exam it's a final year mbbs exam how can you expect it to be easy how can you expect it to be not difficult still it is easier to prepare for one difficult exam rather than bearing a burden of two to three difficult exams secondly there is a confusion regarding the difficulty level of next itself let me sort it out in two aspects next as a qualifying exam if it is really very difficult very few mbbs students will pass the country will get less number of doctors government's investment into medical education will be a waste so they will have to adjust the difficulty level so that at least 60 to 80% mbbs students pass this exam and enter the internship so that is the position of M uh, next as a qualifying exam if we talk of next as a competitive exam then difficulty level does not matter at all because irrespective of how difficult the exam is those who will be more capable will score more and get a better rank and get a pg seat moreover health minister mansukh mandviya has already declared that next exam will not be more difficult than neat pg this they have already declared even if next is more difficult than neat pg to fill all pg seats nmc always adjusts the qualifying cutoff right for example in 2023 the neat pg qualifying cutoff was reduced to zero thirdly there is a fear about next exam because of its proposed pattern as per the draft published by nmc next exam will have 540 mcqs it will be conducted over 3 days each day there will be two sessions with lunch break in between i have already discussed the unfairness of this pattern in my another video but you cannot oppose next exam because of its pattern simply because pattern of any exam can be changed at any given point of time and it does change i remind you that pattern of neat pg has been evolving drastically in last 5 years so pattern keeps on changing effect of pattern on next will be nullified as being a competitive exam pattern of exam is a common thing which affects all the students equally the myth that next is going to be a super difficult exam and end of mbbs dream has the fourth dimension as well and it is the most interesting aspect of it it is very clear that next exam will be mainly clinical so it's going to be a clinically oriented exam totally pre and para clinical subjects taken together will hardly have 10% weightage in next exam 90% questions will be from the clinical subject now listen carefully all the teachers who teach pre and para clinical subjects in medical colleges are okay with this pattern but the teachers who teach pre and para clinical subjects in coaching classes are not comfortable with this pattern because it drastically reduces their importance and their role in coaching for next exam उनके तो रोजी रोटी का ही सवाल खड़ा हो गया वेर विल प्री एंड पैरा क्लिनिकल टीचर्स इन कोचिंग क्लासेस को 
so they started writing articles about next exam being unfair being very difficult they started percolating the fear about next being a super difficult exam you compare next with neat pg if you see the subject wise mark distribution in neat pg around 50% marks are devoted to pre and para clinical subjects what is more appropriate or easier in final year studying every enzyme in krebs cycle studying rare anti cancer drugs none of which you will ever use in your lifetime or it is easier and more appropriate to study clinical subjects and just related pre and para clinical subjects it's very obvious that subject wise mark distribution in next exam is much more fair as compared to neat pg so friends don't fall prey of these rumors regarding next exam more importantly start preparing for it all the best